Hi Scorpios, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be your reading. So the first card you have out there is number 13. It is the card of the sun, which is actually a beautiful energy to have. I feel that some of you may be coming to some clarity in a situation uh, coming up over the next few days. I do see the sun has some really amazingly um, ice blue eyes. I don't know if you can really see that, but some of you may be dealing with someone who just has mesmerizing eyes, or that could be you. I also feel that whatever this clarity is, it's something from the heart. It's something about the heart. Um, so maybe you're realizing, you know, something about someone that you really care about. Let's see what's coming up for you. Um, we have the three of wands as the first card. Now, you could also be realizing somewhere where you want to be. Somewhere where the sun is, somewhere where you feel best, um, because I do feel out there in the horizon, we have that sun setting energy, right? You may want to go somewhere before the sun sets. Um, okay, let's see what that's about. For Scorpio. Well, there could be a possible ending coming in or like you want a renewal. We really have to look into this more, but this is the judgment card. You could be hearing your calling to go and return somewhere. We have the Empress card coming out. Could be to a fire sign, um, someone you really care about, someone who is very loving, motherly, like goddess energy. Okay, let's see what else is coming up for Scorpio. Wow. Okay, so we have the Six of Cups energy. So this is definitely saying you have clarity about a situation there's someone that you want to return to. It could be someone who you've kind of been hiding from for a while. I do see the Nine of Pentacles sticking out. Um, this could be someone you even left before. This could be someone who is single at the moment, or at least you're hoping they're single. Um, okay, let's see what else comes out here. Oh, yeah, you're hoping. The Wheel of Fortune. Because I think that whoever this is is a good catch. And I do think that you're going to be making this move quite soon with the World card. Or you're hoping this person, well, oh, look at that, the hangman in reverse. Um, or you're hoping this person will have a, a fresh start with you, will give you another chance. You know, will not keep you hanging. Very interesting. I do feel that you could be dealing with the fire sign, seeing how we are dealing with the sun energy. And just keep on seeing fire energy pop out. So I'm seeing the Ten of Swords here. Let me just pick that up. Um, I'm not sure if it's meant to be reversed or what, but obviously something had happened. We'll look into that, actually, because I am seeing the Emperor energy here as well. Okay, let's see what the Ten of Swords is about. I really just feel like you really want a fresh start. You've matured now. Emperor in reverse, or not Emperor in reverse, um, Hierophant in reverse, and the Emperor is still here sticking out at the bottom, right? So what ended is a connection, but who is this connection with? I'm not 100% sure. We have another card flipped over here. The Three of Pentacles, it's not telling me too much just yet. So there was a connection that ended. It could have been a marriage. Okay, um, that could be what's over, or okay, well... I mean, we're just getting more end energy here with the death card. So I feel like someone, because it's interesting, like behind the death card, it's almost like something had ended and then someone was standoffish. They were like, don't bug me. I'm not in a good mood. I'm still hanging on to whatever's over. Um, you know, don't come here type of thing really in their emotions Scorpio that could have been you um really in your emotions so what changed really is what we need to know healing is what changed we have this and what's falling out here the um the knight of cups as well so healing has changed you've gotten out of your emotions you're seeing clearer now you know what you want there is this person that I feel that you're in love with. I'm seeing the eight of wands stick out. And probably you want to make an offer to this person. And you want to say, hey, do you want to start over? Do you want to start fresh? Do you want to try this again? But really, I mean, you're determined here. So let's clarify that three of wands. Ooh, that was quick. You are determined to get this fulfillment, to have this beautiful love. 
So how's this person feeling about Scorpio then? Let's see. Well, I mean, this person is definitely still attracted to you, but I'm also um, getting the vibe that you knew this person when you were young. So this person's memories from the past are fond. They're they're about a lot of passion. It's about, about love. Um, it's about fun, energy. That's how this person looks at you, Scorpio. They may look at you as also uh, maybe being a little chaotic or maybe just explosive energy, but also very welcoming. I'm seeing the sun and the moon. So I think that this person feels that you are a great match. This person may feel like, I don't know, you're a force to be reckoned with as well. That you're a lot of fun. You like to do crazy things. Um, I do think that this person still does care about you. Okay, so let's see. What's going to happen in this situation? Scorpio, we have the three of pentacles. This is about a new opportunity to happen here. Because that's a painter. To the two of pentacles. That's interesting. See what else to the ace of swords so definitely a decision is made here um, possibly to even drop there's two energies here it's like someone you i'm not going to say someone it's like you want a brand new start and it almost looks as though you also want to pursue your creative endeavors um, let me just check on that Scorpio's creative endeavors. Yeah, you may feel like abandoning your old life, to be honest, to go for love. And a creative pursuit here. Okay, so let's get a little more here for Scorpio. Fresh start in something you're very passionate about. Passionate about. Okay, let's get some more cards. So let's see. What will be happening for Scorpios? So that three of gems keeps on coming out. I do feel that you are going towards someone else and you are going to make an offer to work on things with them. Uh, it may be a fire sign, just like we said. It may also be someone who, well, I don't know why you, I think you've had investments with this person it would be the better way to put it. Here's the emperor um, with the strength card. You really may have have invested in this person. You may have looked at this person as your perfect match. You may have a lot of passion with this person. So that's interesting. Two of shells, romance is what's coming out. That is really interesting. Let's get some more cards again, back to these. Okay, tell us more about Scorpio and what's coming up here. So there is gonna be some challenges. What would the challenge be? Oh, the challenge would be getting this person out of their head. Um, so I'm guessing memories from the past. You're going to tell this person, hey, you're not going to have any issues anymore. I'm here to stay. Um, but this person is in their head about the past, okay? Hmm. Could it be that you made an offer to this person uh, to have a lot, to do a lot together, and you didn't actually come through with that because that is showing up here? So that could be the memories this person is thinking of. Anyhow, I'm going to move this into the extended and see what's going to happen with this. I'm going to get another deck of cards out and pull some more messages to see exactly what's going on. Thank you so much, Scorpios. Hope to see you on Patreon. Bye for now.